Hello! Welcome back to Hogwarts once again. We're still in this wonky looking jester hat. I don't- We're gonna go with it. Okay. Um. Anyways. Back to the quest grind. I always forget where- What in earth? I don't remember all that be- What is happening? Okay, oh, oh my god. Oh my god, we have never had this many quests at once. Holy. Uh-huh, okay. Um. class wait does that mean i can get pets and whatnot okay first off let's do the broom one we have to go to hogsmeade for that well oh never mind okay uh get out the way Whoopsies. Hello. Welcome back. I've arranged a special price on the broom upgrade for you. I truly appreciate all of your help. How much? A thousand dollars. You'll be thrilled with that broom. I guess. I promise you. <sighs> I must tell you, half of Oxmead's been by the shop asking about rumors of a broom upgrade. Without the information you provided, my work would have taken twice as long. Thank you again. You're welcome. It may sound ambitious, but I've already begun work on another upgrade, more difficult to perfect than the last. I wondered, would you be interested in joining forces again? There's another course near Irondale that Miss Reyes has mastered. If you were to test this first upgrade there, it may help me as I develop the next. Oh, you'll consider it, won't you? I guess, sir. What more can you tell me about the next course? It's just a jaunt from here, south of Oxford. Beautiful mountain views. The course was designed to test flyer stamina. Some of your classmates mentioned they were headed there, eager to see what Imelda has in store. A bit surprising, considering many of them expressed reticence at the idea of racing against her at all. I hope that won't deter you, and you'll give the course a go. At least think on it. No, I'll do it, because I have Sounds to. Sounds as if you're really <laughs> outdoing yourself. If I'm able to help, I will. Thank you. 
I know this recent success was only the beginning of what I can do for Broom Flight. Okay. Report back as soon as you can, and we'll be off to the races. Uh huh. So. Off to the races then. Off I go. Wee. Are these the balloons I have to pop? <laughs> I guess we'll figure that out once I get to that. Excuse me. I'll have taken your life before you even realize it's gone. Who just Who just said that? Here we are. Mr. Weeks wasn't wrong about the mountain views. If it isn't the second best Slytherin. Oh, second best my ass. Why are you holding the broom like that? Hello. Hello, Melda. So, another trial? Of course it's another trial. And you'd better be taking part. Um. Does this mean you've changed your mind about me? Well, you're a step up from the good-for-nothings who usually challenge me. Well, they sit around and hope to be the best. I put in hours of practice. No one sets records by wishing for them. I don't and care. And I need strong competition to stay on top of my game. Are you going to try to beat my flying record or not? You didn't even give me a chance. Strong competition? Could that have been a compliment, Imelda? <laughs> Go ahead. Believe what you want makes no difference compliments make people soft no one goes around telling me i did a fine job and do i care no I yeah i think you do and that's all i need so please try to beat my record fifth year and don't be disappointed when you lose lose 
I'm ready to fly. Finally, a decent challenge. Okay, are we just like going into it right away? Or, oh, we are, okay. <laughs> okay. I'm getting the hang of this. I'm a wee bit scared. Uh oh. Ah. Ah. I almost ran into that. Oh my goodness. Okay. Uh oh. Can I start over? <laughs> Brilliant. It might not matter. I might go quick enough that the penalty doesn't matter. I just can't mess up anymore. Where do I go? Oh my god. You didn't even tell me where it was. Are you kidding? Well, this definitely didn't go as smooth as the last race we did, but we do it, we do it. Okay. Get up there. This is the last one? Okay, 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 okay. How did I do? How did I do? So, did I win? Or did I not? You've improved, I must admit. That was a bloody good run. Be careful. Earn a reputation. So did I win? Here, and some people get put out about it. Sounds like you're speaking from experience. Yes, well, I am. Anyway, you didn't do abysmally. I can't deny that. But you'll not have the same luck on the South Coast course. You said your reputation for talent put some people out. Like whom? <sighs> If you must know, I've had to deal with jealousy from members of our house. When we were first years, Nerida Roberts and I spent loads of time on our brooms, pledged to fly every day. As my skill on a broom grew, rapidly I might add, Nerida suddenly didn't have time for flying practice. I tried to give her pointers, but she didn't have the natural ability I did. Clearly, she was jealous. Her thing spends all her time now dawdling by the lake, obsessed with mer people. Won't even learn to swim. I refuse to downplay my talents to coddle someone else's fragile ego. <sighs> anyway, I need to ready the next course. Stop by when it's ready, if you can handle it. Okay. We'll see, won't we? Till next time. <laughs> I half expected you to back down. Rest on your laurels. See you at the South Coast trial. If you don't lose your nerve. Well, I'm I'm probably gonna have to, to do race either way. This course again. Visit the podium with the leaderboard, where you can start the race and check your time. I wanna see it. Oh. Another successful flight. Wait. I should let Mr. Weeks know. Where's hers? Girl, what I thought whatever. I am not flying all the way back over there. That was ridiculous. <gasps> Wait. Is there a flu flame here? Please tell me there is. Oh, where are you? Oh my god, I needed those before. <gasps> I'm taking those, don't mind if I do. 
How is there not a flu flame thing? Whatever. Okay. Back from your latest flight. Yes. I want to hear all the particulars. Good news, Mr. Weeks. With your upgrade, I was able to set a new record at the Eindel course. Brilliant! I knew the upgrade had fantastic potential. How did your broom feel? It rides well. It does get a tad shaky at top speed, and the handle wobbles a bit when I hit a strong gust of wind. Ah, oh, yes. Hmm, I see. I think I know how to address that. Thank you. I owe you one. If it means another upgrade, the pleasure's all mine. You sound <laughs> as determined as I am to improve broom flight. It's a joy to have a collaborator like yourself. If I'm right, and I do hope I am, you'll be hearing good news from me soon. Fabulous. Could you make Thank it you so again, I truly. am just good without having to do anything? Because I'm not very good at it. Okay. Ooh. I completed a challenge. And I do make a good team. Yes, we do. Now, what quest do I have to do? Okay. That's just gonna happen on its own. What is a troll bogey? So basically, what I'm hearing is I need to find a troll. <laughs> Um. Whoa. Is this gonna tell me where I can go? I wanna know if those balloons I saw- Oh! It does show me where to go! I think. I could be wrong. I don't know. Excuse me. Oops. Okay. This way. Oh yeah. So do I just fly into them? Yep, I do. Okay, easy enough. If one more, where did it go? Over here. Boom. Now, there was... There was something I saw here. Who is it? Oh, is it in here? I... There's something that makes me look like there's a side quest. Think that there's a side quest. But I don't know. Are they down here? No. Has his belongings back. Ranrock and his loyalists will think twice before trying that again. I hope so. Okay, well, I don't know. So we're just gonna... Skirp. Let's go.
Okay. Come here, balloons. You. You. Where? Down here. the last one. Oh, all the way down here. Brilliant. Beautiful. I clicked get off. Huh? Where is she? I'm confused. How did you oh. get away with those tasks? Oh. I just accidentally came in here. Oh, okay. Marvelous news, you'll be joining the faculty at Hogwarts as our new flying instructor. I dare say our work together at Hogwarts will be less eventful than our time near y Yokohama Harbor. Though one never knows, I shall look forward to seeing you soon. If you have any questions in this meantime, in the meantime, please don't hesitate to send me an owl. Okay. Oh, there's another thing? Oh my god. I'm writing to do with Professor Black's decision to cancel Quidditch. As you know, joining a professional Quidditch team. Is this from Imelda? I haven't looked yet. Is my utmost dream and I believe my chances will now be ruined or at least significantly thwarted. Professor Weasley insists that we must defer to the headmaster and she encouraged me to practice on my own. I have devised some challenging trials for myself, but it's not at all the same as practicing on the pitch. Nothing is. Please could I ask you speak to the headmaster or to Professor Weasley. I shall be miserable my whole life if I can't play Quidditch properly for this entire year. It was from Imelda. Oh. Hello. Madam Kogawa, I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? Yeah. Yes, Think. Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. Well, with those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. Yay! Spells. Pay attention okay. to your wand work. Okay, 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 okay. Boom. Did it. I gotta freeze people now? Oh, well she's done. just done. <laughs> I would recommend that you practice your new spell here in my office before taking it out into the world. Deal. Okay. T. Uh. I don't know if I care about the transfiguration one, so I'm just gonna do that. There you go. Catching one quickly. Oh, it literally does freeze. <laughs> Okay. Bet. Anyways, bye. Okay. What is next on our agenda? Um. We're gonna start with potions class and then we're, we're just gonna keep going through the list honestly oh my gosh it's all the way over there Ooh. why was it telling me to go that way that was rude oh 
Thank you. Don't mind if I do. Oh my god, I just found a secret. No! Uh. A sun hat? Let me in, okay. Okay. <gasps> Sebastian! Oh my god, my bad. <laughs> Got a wee bit excited. Um. That seemed like a very eventful class. I didn't even have to actually do it. Your assignments coming along? Good, I think. I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. You should be ready to learn to pulso. Let's see what you can do. Deal. Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. Okay, 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 okay. That was easy. <laughs> You've oh. got it now. If you'd like to practice, and I think you Rebellion. should, perhaps best not to go flinging your cards. I suggest having a go at the enchanted books here. Oh, I'm sorry. I did the wrong thing. Um, hello? I'm frozen! Are you kidding? Because I took this one out and I was not gonna let me. Stop. Well done. I'm glad to see that you seem staunchly determined to master your spell casting. Can I hit. Mm, it's probably not a good idea. <laughs> Okay. Well, ooh, I probably should try and upgrade. I don't remember which one it was. So then I can get more spells. That's not what I meant though. I mean like, wait, what? Oh, I can buy these. <gasps> That's not bad. Isn't it this one? Got it. I'm gonna get all of those. What is this? Oh. This one could actually be nice. It like shoves them all away from me. Whoa, that one's cool. Um, 
I'm gonna get that one. I have two more. I would like that one. I don't use potions really, so I'm gonna ignore that. And then for now, we're gonna get this one. Okay. Okay, so. I have both of those, both of those. Put that one there, Akio there. Just for now, I guess. Oh, I don't know why I did that. <laughs> Isn't that how it's supposed to be? Is like at some point you're like, Ch -ch 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 -ch. let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Oh no, that's not true. Anyways, okay. Now on to Professor Garlic. I have to admit, I'm very excited to learn Wingardium Leviosa. Pause. The Daily Key. Where are you off to, little key? Oh, there's a chest here too. Thank you. <laughs> I also need to make a trip to the common room and put some of those in there because I have like three now. Oh. What is that? Interesting. Why'd she look at me like that? <laughs> oh. here for I would like to talk to you I've completed my assignments professor pleased to hear it professor Weasley will be too I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along thank you professor professor Hecket tells me she taught you levioso so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm Wingardium leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a nice graceful wand movement. Ooh. Let's see you try your hand at it. Is this going to be a complicated one that I actually mess up? When executed correctly, oh, or not. you should be able to pick up <laughs> boulders as though they were sprigs of sneezewort. Okay. La 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 la. Easy. Are you going to make me practice it? Uh oh you can move oh Okay well done Feel free to practice Wingardium Leviosa here in the greenhouse Sorry I just cut you off Breaks out for you in the next room So oh, 
Am I a natural? <gasps> oh my god. Got a potion. I'm gonna pick all of these up now. Oh my god, there's more. I thought I was gonna have to stack them. <gasps> Get off of my wand. Where's more? Oh, a chest. I'll take that. Heck yeah. Well. Okay. How many? Oh my god, we only have four out of 16 of those? Jeez Louise. That's just to do the trial. Oh my god, okay. Um, this is something that I think is just gonna happen. So... Oh, that one's to, like, unlock doors, right? Okay, we're gonna do this one first. Beast class, because I'm just gonna be honest, if this means I can get pets... Sounds kind of fun, if you ask me, but... Handy resource indeed, your field guide. Why are you talking about my field guide so much? I don't really care. Open sesame! Is there something going on in here? Are y'all just sitting here waiting for me? What is that? Welcome, everyone. Hello. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. <laughs> Pluck the body like that. <gasps> None of these creatures should be taken lightly. They are all in their own way dangerous. Especially if one does not know how to handle them properly. Fair enough. Oh. Now, it seems many of you are out of practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howen. Hello, I'm Poppy. Poppy Sweeting. Don't worry about Professor Howen's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> In class are perfectly safe. Oh! Miss Sweeting, pay attention, please. The tongue of a puffskin can be a slippery devil. Uh, yes, Professor. Here, you can practice. Awkward. On Just keep an eye out for his tongue. <laughs> He's cute. He's a little puffball. You can use my brush. Just be gentle. Oh, oh and think pleasant thoughts. I like to think it enriches his experience. Um. Tap T. Oh, a brush. Okay, so I even have to have them in here. That's lovely. I'm sure he feels much better. I think he might be hungry. Would you mind giving him some beast feed? Yeah. Nom nom. What do you suppose the pellets taste like to Gerald? Pudding, I like to think. Um, I think we can dirt. safely say that Gerald likes you. That's He's cute. He seems very nice. He is. 
Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition and cleanliness. Ambition? Good work, everyone. Now, let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. Okay. And please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. Miss Sweeting, why don't you show our new student to the Neasles in the farthest pen? This What's way, a the Neasles are over here. Oh, that. Right. I feel like these could buy my face off. Couple of knees or whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy something from Honey Jeeks. Stupid thing. What are you doing? What are you doing? Tus tus peculiar poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent. Her name is Persephone. <laughs> Her name is Persephone. <laughs> That's really not funny. Yeah, no kidding. <sighs> Let's go. Ew. They're cute. Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. No, they don't. Coaches in training. Persephone was on to them instantly. Thank you for your help. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the knees oh. just as you did with Gerald. Okay. <laughs> I did the it. The really took to you. They know a good egg when they see one. As do I. It appears our time has come to an end. I'm not done yet. Please close the pens and see yourselves out. Now, where is our new student? I'm over here. Ah, there you are. I would like a moment, please. Okay, that's fine. I just had to finish feeding the kitties. <laughs> Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first beast lesson? I loved them. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good. You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. Some provide us with magically imbued materials, if cared for correctly, which does not include torturing them for whiskers. Well done, by the way. Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, Deal. Professor. They're nearly as bad as the savages in Rookwood's poacher pack. Sadly, we're the ones who suffer. Stumbling over dead beasts. Terrible waste of resources. That's sad. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice by someone. The Ministry <gasps> of Arms. Hmm. An optimistic idea. Now. Why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other fifth year. Be on the lookout for my owl. Meanwhile, I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. Okay, here's my question. I need to talk to you. Come here. <laughs> Hold on, I'm talking. So a couple episodes ago, I we were running around doing our thing, right? And we ran into those like I'm assuming they're poachers or whatever she called them. But remember, there was a niffler in a cage, and I killed the people, and then it wouldn't let me get the niffler out. I wonder if I can get them out now. Did you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to those brutes so that I didn't have to. You were an augury at noon in the desert. I, I don't know what that means. I certainly hope that's a good thing. <laughs> it's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. At least that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't okay. stand there and watch them harm the poor thing. We're of a similar mind. Actually, in light of that, there's someone I'd like you to meet in the forest. Why? You've intrigued Why the me. forest? Very well. Lead the way. I'd hoped I would. Okay. 
Oh, she's going. Okay. I wouldn't take just anyone there. In fact, you're the first. Uh huh. Well, thank you. I think. As I said, we think alike. Pleasant surprise. You run slow. Having, don't you think? Poppy, where are you taking me? It really is much better if I just show you. Can you run a little bit quicker? Don't worry, we're nearly there. It's just ahead. Okay. Stand back. Um... Show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before you approach them. What? I'm approaching them. <laughs> oh. I did it. I think. someone oh. this quickly you can feed and brush her if you'd like yes i come and check on her every once in a while bring her pasties tell her what's going on in the castle you wouldn't know from looking at her but she's a dreadful busybody oh i love her oh oh bye Okay. <laughs> Just gave her food and she dipped. Okay. Rude. So, what did you think of High Wing? I want her. I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe you introduced me to her. I suspected you two might get along. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hmm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? Oh. I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and Highwing cross paths? It's a longer story, but I rescued her from poachers a few years back, got her to safety, and, well, she was fine until recently. You what does that mean? You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem in the area, so I worry they could get her again, and that I might not be there next time. Professor Howen mentioned the poachers as well. She seemed to imply that we couldn't rely on the Ministry to help. I don't often agree with Professor Howen, but on that, I fear she's right. The poachers' influence is growing. I see them every day in the village, lingering, talking to people. They're up to something. I'm just not sure what. That's nice. That does seem strange. Sounds as if they're planning something. Exactly. I think I'm going to look into it. Find out what's going on. What they're doing. I think that's a fine idea. Information is power. And the more I know, the better I can keep Highwing safe. You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find out? Oh, very well. I will. I should be going, but we'll speak again soon, I hope. I want a hippogriff. Okay. Oops. Okay. do this one first just because I kind of want to learn that spell <laughs> I hate to see a creature get put down
Is that? I'd much prefer it if everyone could see. Ah, you'd be so foolish as to get caught flying away from the police guard. When my mother was here. What is this? Okay. I don't know. helped her in a while that was like one of the first couple episodes Ooh. i thought i saw something never mind okay oh, hello. where'd you go i used the light transfiguration hold on hold on there was like a flying page too here duh okay another one down now we continue on oh hey it's me gareth do you have a moment <sighs> I guess. Were you calling me, Gareth? I was. After you helped me with that fruper feather and potions, oh, I reckon I forgot you might be that just him. the person I need. You see, I have an idea for a fizzing, wisby inspired beverage, but I'm missing a key ingredient. <sighs> don't make me... Oh. You and your concoctions. I don't know how you come up with these things. It's a gift, truly. So, oh, okay. I suspect the key ingredient in fizzing whisbies is dried billywig stings. I heard there's a store of them in Honeyduke's cellar. I'd get them myself, but my Aunt Matilda has her eye on me. Thinks I need to focus on potions class for a while, not for my own bruise. Probably. I was hoping you could follow a secret passage to Honeyduke's cellar and grab a few dried billywig stings for me. Don't know if I want to. Sounds simple enough. But and I will. who wouldn't <laughs> want to go to Honeyduke's? Ah. Brilliant. Thank you. The passage is hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch in the third floor corridor. Just tap it with your wand and say, Descendium. What? Couldn't you have someone buy the dry billywig stings? They're not for sale, and you never know when the cellar's going to be locked. So, the reliable way in and out is through the secret entrance. <sighs> Are you asking me to steal from a shop? Goodness! It's not as if I'm asking you to rob Gringotts. Honey Dukes is more than enough, and I only need a few. It's a sweets ingredient. They won't be missed. Trust me. Man, I don't want to steal. I'll see what I can do, Gareth. Fair enough. 
You shall be the first one to taste my newest brew if you can be of help. I Perhaps I can care. convince some meat to help me with my potions homework. Get my aunt to loosen her reins a bit. I'll need to get those dried billywig stings for Gareth if he's to finish his latest concoction. A I... uh, one-eyed witch statue shouldn't be too hard to find. And then meet me in my classroom to learn Defindo, the severing charm. Oh. It's typically used to cut an object, but can be a powerful weapon when needed. Oh, there's another one of these. I swear I heard it. I heard a little... <laughs> Oh, well, I didn't even mean to find that, but hey. I don't know what that does. What are you up to now? I'm confused. <laughs> Where is it? This looks like the right statue. Oh. Now, what was the password? Descendium. Man, I don't want to steal! Who knew this was all down here? Okay, but why is everyone always trying to get me in trouble? <laughs> What's up with that? Can I at least get stuff? Oh, this looks... Mm. A lift. Must be how I get down. Looks broken, though. Well... Is this a job? Ah, ha, ha. Wow. That was a lot more broken than I thought it was. That seems to have done the trick. Will never cease to surprise me. I swear, this is giving me spider vibes, and I'm not. What is it telling me? My gears are my my gears, my gears full for. How would you like to learn the knockback jinx flippendo? Once you've completed the necessary tasks, come and find me in the greenhouse. <gasps> stop, 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 there's more. I am not about. <laughs> I swear this game hates me. That's a lot. Oh, man. Can I go around the other way? Oh. Please tell me there's not actual spiders and it's just, you know, a ha, a ha ha coincidence. Oh my god. I'm trapped. 
How am I supposed to get out of here? Yeah, what? Lumos. Um. Oh. Okay. I just okay. <laughs> there are noises that I do not like. I'm going to have to get past this. Okay, now I jump. And, um, where's my repair? repair? There we go. Now fly. Oh, oh, wrong one, my bad. Lumos. Fly, Lumos. not Lumos. Ah. Woo! Okay. Stop with the spiders! Is this a secret way? No. Repair. So I keep pushing the wrong button. Something is getting in the way of that platform. Oh, that. Ah. Uh. Mm hmm. It must be this thing? No! Oh, I'm dumb. I did get it. That did the trick. Yoink. This must be the way out. Hmm. I need to find a way to open that gate. Something's telling me Incendio. it's gonna be to light things on fire. <laughs> Something smells sweet. Must be close to honey juice. Oh. What am I supposed to collect? I feel like I'm gonna get caught. Oh, and it's a cutscene, it's never good. Okay, do I need to... I'm gonna try and stay Hi, hidden. Jukes. I can smell the chocolate. Goodness no. gracious! Billywig stings for Gareth. I'm very nervous to be doing this, I gotta be honest. I am such a goody two shoes and I'm like, it's in a game. I have the dried Billywig stings. Now, back to Gareth. I can only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out. Why is this all highlighted? I don't know if I want to know. Why did I sound like I heard something open? <laughs> ah!
Okay, I think I did it. I feel like I don't actually have to go all the way back. Oh, I don't have a map. Well, I didn't mean to do that, but here we are. <laughs> I'll take that. Sorry, just broke my ankles. Oh! I feel like I deserve some compensation for just staling from somebody. Okay, where is he? Hold on, where was that? I heard the little fluttery thing. Hello. I don't know where it went. <laughs> Hello, Gareth. I have those dried bilirubin stings. You got them. Incredible. Ah, <sighs> I should say there's a fee, but I'm gonna be nice. Happy to help. Here you go. This is brilliant. Can't wait to get started. Thank you again. I'll let you know when I brewed my first batch of fizzing whiz beer. <sighs> okay, I forgot where else I was supposed to go. This. Slowing objects or people in midair. Simply complete a few tasks and then come and see me. Man, they are loading me up.
Hello, oh hey. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, a Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. Hello. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. <laughs> I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. His eyeballs look crazy. I call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not. Uh, and from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. Okay. Do you see that curious statue over there? Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. Oh. <laughs> what the heck? What is now, that? If you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. Oh, odd little contraptions, mm. aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed, which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. Fuck uh, ever since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Okay. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. Torment you. See, you. that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart, or, or shapeshifter, if you will. Uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. This one took the form of a demiguise. A demiguise? <gasps> yes. <laughs> Terrifying creature that can see the future. <sighs> Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. Uh, those statues are demiguises. Oh the moons, I assume, are an uninspired play on. Some jackanapes used a boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. I have my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmead has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I, I simply can't bring myself to go near them. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Perhaps you could start simply by removing them so uh, I can go about my evening duties. What? The faculty tower? I'm not sure I should be going in there. Oh, you needn't worry. Uh, you'll be perfectly fine if you simply mind you're not seen. Oh. <laughs> uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Mm. You'll want to do that before wandering the tower at night. Okay. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However will you get in? Hmm. Alahamora, that's how. But what about curfew? Curfew? Oh, tosh. I sense you're a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, the school was my oyster. <laughs> and I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now, you'll find one statue in the prefect's bathroom and the other in the hospital wing. Good luck. Oh, and thank you. Why is even he trying to get... Oh, boy. Okay, hold on. Um... did it okay um where is it 
Oh, I don't need it. It's just there. Ah. Oh, you actually have to do it? Use Q and E and A and D. What am I doing? So both corresponding gears are activated to release the lock. Huh? I do it. I don't actually know how I just did that, but I did well it. Done. You're in. Remember, use a disillusionment charm so no one claps eyes on you. Okay. This is a restricted area of the castle. After all. Yeah. Thanks for being a member of faculty and telling me that I oh. have to do this. Got it. What is going on? <laughs> So basically, I'm just rummaging through everything. Ooh, what's this? Dear Mirabelle, my dear Dot has been asking after you. Perhaps I can convince her to stop in for a butterbeer or two if you were to join us. It's been far too long. When you do manage to come by, I wonder if you'd be able to part with a few of your plants, the more fragrant ones. Ever since the troll attack, customers have been complaining about the smell of, believe it or not, old socks. Nothing I've tried seems to cover the stench. Hoping to see you soon with or without the plants, your friend Serona. Okay. <gasps> Ooh. Oh my god. In your seat of your most recent owl, apologies for the delay in my response. I am still receiving a good deal of correspondence regarding the introduction of the not so recent stooging penalty in Quidditch which in my humble opinion has brought the game into modern age. Astonishing, frankly, how many spectators want nothing less than seeing Quidditch keepers flattened entirely. As to the topic of your recent letter, we at the Ministry assure you that any and all potential threats to wizard kind are taken quite seriously. I have made note of your concerns and, and as much as time allows, the Department of Magical Law Enforcement will ensure that the matter is looked into, schedule permitting. The value, the we value the opinions of esteemed wizards such as yourself, and you may rest assured that we have matters well in hand. Should you wish, I can have my secretary secure seats for yourself and a guest in this year's Quidditch final. I think you'd be delighted to see the results of a well-run and efficient government. Okay. Don't think that is what matters to him, but I could be wrong. Oh. Oh, there's a key in here. Oh. oh, I don't know if she can see me or not, but that was a little spooky. <laughs> oh. Really, it reveals authority fears and allowing you to scout ahead and remain undetected. Oh my god. 
Ready to staff, the Hogwarts house elves do an exceptional job of keeping the castle in order. They are seldom unprepared for any number of items that they might encounter each day. However, only the other day, an unexpected stash of wizarding crackers went off from behind a cushion. The <laughs> Engulfing <laughs> one for elf in blue smoke and giving those of us nearby an abominable ring on our ears for the rest of the day. I expect that culprit was Peeves. Please keep an eye on be careful. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go do this. Am I still gonna be invisible? Eek. I am. Perfect. Okay. Now we gotta figure out how to distract this girl. to get in here? Hello, Amora. Got it. Now, did I just get caught though? Ah. Like to be overjoyed to know that the local children have been taking to playing globsons in the recent in the street just outside of your study window. They're quite charming, I must say. I noticed the youngest was without her own set of globsons, so I lent her one of yours. I knew you wouldn't mind. I do hope things are going well at the castle. I'm relieved that you arrived safely. Dreadful story about the gentleman from the ministry. Was he really traveling with Elzar and a student? Simply dreadful. 
Do write when you have a moment. I'm most eager to hear stories of this year's Summoner's Core participants. Your students so adore you, my dear. With love, M. Do I need to get in there? How are your students getting along this year? Whoa. Rather poorly, I'd say. Is that so? We're raising a generation of coddled cape flappers that can scarcely tell the difference between Arcanite and Asphodel. Yes, well. It's still early. Perhaps they'll improve. You say that every year, Matilda. I'm scared. There's another one of those. Oh. <gasps> You saw nothing. 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 Jeez Louise. Where? Ah. Hello, Mora. I don't think I'm doing this right. I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared. Um... Perhaps Ranrock and Hisop wouldn't be so competent if the Ministry would allow them 
Hello, Amora. Oh, there's a lock on a chest. Okay, I indeed was not doing it quickly, but now I know how to do it. <laughs> be kidding me I got that dang fall. No. I have to start the whole thing over. Oh my god. Oh no, it says I already got the one in the. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, we're gonna speed run this. Oh, they're not even there anymore. Oh. Okay, back to being quiet. No one heard that. <laughs> Did it say... I kept this. Yes. Okay. Hallelujah. What was that? Could you by chance go the other way? Please. You weren't supposed to go upstairs. Why would you go upstairs? What? I need to go upstairs. Bet a few galleons on Hufflepuff this season. This is dumb. I am mad at you for making me do this. Just wanted to let you know that, Mr. Whatever your name is. Okay, speedrun for real now. 
You have never been in that spot before. Okay, hopefully we get more lucky with the t Stop being by the stairs! Why must you do this to me? That doesn't... <gasps> Yikes. Please tell me he's gonna go further down now and not just stand right there. Please don't stand. Oh no. <laughs> Why do you go upstairs? bet a few galleons on Hufflepuff this season. Hufflepuff? Not Ravenclaw? Yikes. I know. Okay. Okay, grabbing, grabbing, grabbing. Whoa. Please just turn around, go back. Professor Garlic, please just turn around. <laughs> You're not supposed to be looking at me still. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're getting out, we're getting out, we're getting out. Yee Yikes. Okay. We are just gonna go all the way over by the- Rah. This is nerve-wracking. Okay. Oh my god, no, she's right there. Okay, well, you know what? What did I just hear that was all sparkly sounding? Incendiary. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. We made it past. We made it past. We're fine. Going back down. That was ridiculous. Hello, Mr. Moon. 
I have the moons you asked me to collect. Oh, goodness! You're as fearless as I'd hoped. An excellent start. Uh, if we can collect more, it may shed some light on who's behind all this. Of course, I first suspected Peeves. He drove the previous caretaker, rancorous carp, to an early retirement with his intolerable buffoonery. But that does not explain the boggart in Oxme, does it? No. I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my tormentor. Why? It's definitely intriguing. I'd like to help you solve this mystery. I don't really uh, want you, to. my friend, are a gentle person and a, a scholar. And I have something to offer in exchange for your assistance. Okay. Now, remember, the moons are only retrievable at night. Thus, I encourage you to use a disillusionment when necessary. Okay. How many statues are there to find? I don't know precisely, but I've spotted dozens. Seems they're everywhere I look. You have your work cut out for you, if you were to ever unravel their meaning. You mentioned offering something in exchange for my assistance. I did. Uh, once you've brought me enough moons, I'll show you even more powerful forms of Alahamora. Not every lock is as easy to pick as the faculty towers. Mm-hmm. Understood. I shall keep an eye out. I appreciate that. Okay. <sighs> oh, I, I knew you were the one to ask for help. Uh, keep at it so we can solve this mystery. That was dumb. You are just trying to cause a ruckus. Ooh, level 19. <sighs> okay, well. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna run over to the Slytherin. Uh, I forgot which one it was. The Slytherin common room. And... Okay, yeah, and like what... Where is my thing? Why do I not know where the... There we go. Okay. Oh, my ban. We're gonna put Another in house token for the, house the ones we got. Oh. It makes me do it one at a time. This Dedalian Keys challenge is coming along nicely. It is. We made more progress than I thought we would. Um, we are gonna end it here. Um I try to keep these episodes like fairly short, put together, whatever. Oh, Hey, <laughs> he's a ghost. Why does he have to open the door? Anyways, we're just going to use this episode as like a catching up thing, getting some quests done, whatever. We made a good start and then he just kept giving me more. But 
that's fine. We'll pick it up next time. And next time, I'm going to assume we're probably going to go to the three broomsticks, get that quest done, and start making our way through more of the side quests and then the, what's it called? The stuff for the map chamber and the trials and all that. But yeah, like I said, we're going to leave it here today. Um, hopefully you enjoyed, had some fun, you know, whatever. But with that, I will leave it here and I will see you guys next week. Bye.